Hello, 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 my lovelies. How are you doing? How's your day? Um, I have literally just finished my uh, week three cash stuffing um, so that I could then, <laughs> oh no, that's the wrong one, <laughs> do my completed challenges reallocation. I am so excited. <laughs> okay, so let's see what we've got. Look at that. That is amazing. Um, we completed the car pamper challenge um, this month um, and I immediately unstuffed it and um, sorted out my car. It got lots of lovely smellies. It got a pamper. It got a wax. It got a buff. It got everything. Um, and um, yeah, so that money isn't in here. However, we do have all of this other lovely stuff and things. So let's let's unstuff everything. Where should I put these out of the way? And let's work out how much money I have managed to save for last month. Well, and part of this month, <laughs> technically, I guess. Uh, so how is your savings challenges going? Are you, um, I did hear that June slash July is a little bit difficult for some people um, because you kind of, I don't know, it's the middle of the year, you've maybe completed some goals but maybe not some others. Um, I'm not sure, this is my first year so I'm still quite like fired up. Um, I did have a couple of bad months in April and May and the beginning of June um, where an awful lot of money that I'd saved up went sort of out. Um, and that was that was a little bit sad, <laughs> but it was also really positive because I actually had the money um, and that's the first time I've ever been able to sort of pay and not put something on um on credit and I, I you know there was a lot of things that needed paying for so um it did it did dent my savings a little bit but you know hey <laughs> it's savings um so what have we managed to save I'm going to include that because I want to know exactly what we saved but I'll do that afterwards so 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 2. So I've got 210. That would have made 250. And then I've got 50 in there. So that's 253. Oh, wow. 300 and... 320. That is crazy. Wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, I've kept those in here because these are going to go towards my um, Christmas mini binder in a minute. So let's just pop this here. That is amazing. Oh my goodness. I think I think every cash stuffer on YouTube will say this so many times, but it it just works. It really does. You I, I don't know what it is about putting things in little envelopes. Um but it just you, I, I don't know if it just tells your brain that you can't you can't spend it because you you've assigned it somewhere. Um I love this cash stuffing. <laughs> I am. I. I hope I can keep the motivation going for the rest of my life. You know, I. I would like to be able to retire, and actually have some money in savings. So let me just make sure I've got fifty here. Twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. That's great. What's that? 10, 20, all oh right, 10, 20, 30, 40, and that makes 50. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, so I'm going to change some of this up because these are going to clog up my Christmas folder too much. So that's 
50. Uh, 20, 40. Oh, yeah. And I'm just going to take that back out again. <laughs> now, do I need... Am I putting 25 in each pocket? I am. So let's take... Have we got some janky fives? Yeah, there we go. And then this one saved 20, but I've got a little bit extra in there. That's a bitty bonus. Oh, we'll do something with that. Um, so this saved 20 which means I can go into, where is it? Where's the money saved? There we go. We can go into here where I had some extra money left over. So two, four, six. Let's swap that for two, five, uh, no, a 10. Let's swap that for a 10. So we've got 25 there as well. Pop that in there. Oh, it's all, it all sounds really complicated, but it genuinely isn't. I know what I'm doing in my head. So that means, oh my goodness, that I can fill three more of these. That is crazy. This is going to be completed really, really quickly. Um, so let's just mark them off. Each one of these pockets takes 25 pounds and then when it's fully stuffed that means I will have 300 300 pounds saved for Christmas and I think I might just do this one again um because I, I know I'm going to need more than 300 that is for sure um there we go that's that one and then 25 can go into this pocket it's getting so full <laughs> it's literally bulging oh can you see that there we go he's stuffed as well and i hadn't quite prepared for there to be three pockets so i might not have written on this one to say that i've stuffed it oh i have <laughs> I'm going to swap those two tens for a 20. Do we have a yucky 20? That one. I don't want to put any nice notes in there because I'm just rolling them up. And um, I, I know that um, when I finally unstuff this, I'll be really sad if there's any nice notes that are all crumpled. There you go. So two pockets away from completing the Christmas binder. <laughs> I'm so, so, so happy about that. And what's that? So we're in July. So potentially by August, I will have that done. And if I start this again, then before Christmas, I will definitely have £600 saved. Yay! <laughs> that is absolutely phenomenal. Now, I've got all this change and I do not want all this change. So I'm going to have to. Yeah, what I'll do is I'm going to take some money out of. Here, these are uh, my little envelopes for the different weeks. So £10. £20 and ooh, £30. There we go. And I will pop this money in here so I know I've got to do something with it. And then it just means I don't get confused. <laughs> right, let's do this. I have been waiting all month to be able to put some serious money into this um, my long-term savings or my sinking funds and I cannot wait where do I start um oh I just want to put money everywhere birthdays passports yeah tv license um we always pop a cheeky 20 into tv license um each one of these is worth five so we can mark off this little line here which is brilliant we're halfway through that now and this is for um 
the TV license due. Uh, yes, so I started this in May 2024. This is for the TV license for uh, next year. So that's going to get me ahead nicely. I might put something into Coffee and Treats. Bojo is absolutely fine at the moment. Passports definitely needs some extra love. 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. So each line is worth 20. Um, let's be a bit a bit silly. Let's pop 40 in because I do need a passport. And I just, you know, it's just got to be done. Oh, here we go. This is the wrong colour. <laughs> so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. That is going to be fun to colour in <laughs> later on. Oh, I absolutely love unstuffing completed challenges. Have you finished any important challenges recently, or have you been able to stuff any uh, money into your sinking funds? Um, I kind of concentrate mainly on challenges. And just dribble the odd five pounds into this just so I can see a progression. Um, but the biggest oomph and injection of cash is, is my own stuffing of challenges. Birthdays. Yeah, let's pop. I don't want to go too crazy with birthdays because we're just, we're just letting that one fill quite nicely. Um, health. Here we go. Let's give this a nice little injection of cash. What do we need to fill this one up completely? Uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50. I have enough to do it. Shall I do it? I've got 50 in the bank already. Do you know what? Let's do it. So 20, 30, 40 and 50. Gosh, that is so satisfying. <laughs> oh, that is amazing. So that means I have completed this for the first time. I nearly completed it a couple of months ago, but I had to use it when our pup had to go to the vets. Ding, ding, ding. Can I do a ding, ding on a sinking fund? <laughs> it's not really a challenge, is it? <laughs> So I'm going to start that one again. I'm going to move this money into the bank so it can earn some uh, interest. And then, uh, yeah, definitely want to start that one again. Emergency fund. What have we got left? 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. Oh, we've got so much money. Um, 10, 20, 30, 40. You know what I nearly forgot? <laughs> I nearly forgot to put June into my buffer binder. I knew it just sounded like I had way too much money. Um, so that 40 is going to go into my buffer binder. And my buffer binder is <laughs> it's a bit like a mini emergency binder. It's, it's there if I need it for things where... I don't want to, I don't want to use my emergency fund. I don't want to take money out of my sinking funds. Um, but I'm hoping I can just keep building on this all the way through the year so that I can unstuff it and be really excited about having a wad of money <laughs> to put into things that I need for the, for the year so I can plan ahead. I've already got a £10 bonus amount put into there. And as you know, I'm already saving flies and Julys for the July pocket. Oh my goodness, this is going to be really hard to stuff soon. Hmm. We'll, we'll have to deal with that because I don't want to take the money out. I, I need the money to stay in, in here. We'll have a we'll have a think. <laughs> I might need to put it into a separate binder. <laughs> um, right, so back here. How much have we now got? 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. Okay, so how about we put 20 into emergency? No, 25 into emergency. 
we already have 500 in the bank um so let's start how this is really exciting to be pumping into this again because it would be brilliant to get this to a thousand i've i haven't got a time limit or you know i'm not make, doing a mega push but it would be nice to think that maybe this year i can get it to a thousand I think I can, especially if I maybe do some challenges towards it. I'm quite interested. What what kind of emergency fund do you think you should have? And I mean, what what do you? I was going to say, what do you term an emergency? Um, the only reason I ask that question is I've been watching some other channels and I think they're the more established channels and they've kind of, you know, they fully funded um, appliances and home repairs and health and, you know, all these different things. And then they've gone, well, why do I need an emergency fund now? Because everything's fully funded. Um, I don't I don't need such a big emergency fund. So I'd be really interested to know what what kind of emergency fund you've got or, or what you're aiming towards. Um, if you wouldn't mind sharing that info. <laughs> Just um, I, f I find it helps me. Christmas. Yes, absolutely. Let's put some money into this. Now, this one I have decided is going to be towards my uh, Christmas advent calendar. Um, so we've got 50 in the bank, five pounds. It's been like that for months. So how about we pop fifteen in? Uh I'm going to colour these in off camera, but one, two, three. Oh, that is so brilliant. I'm so happy to finally be able to um to give this one a little bit of love. <laughs> Because I do want to buy an advent calendar this year. I don't think I'm going to buy an, a cash stuffing advent calendar. I think I'm going to buy like um, something treatsy, you know, really spoil myself. So that's great. And I've got £10 left over. Where? Oh, these, by the way, these fantastic, beautiful envelopes are by Rose Budgets. Um, she's on the Etsy and I will leave her a link in my description below. Beautiful, beautiful, stunning, stunning envelopes. Um, done emergency, done health, done birthdays. We've done passports. Oh, we've done well. We've done TV license. We haven't done coffee and treats. Shall, shall I just, shall I? <laughs> yeah, I'm going to pop that in there. And that is me done. I am so happy about that. Um, thank you so much. I hope that wasn't too long a video for you. I really... Uh, I don't have anywhere for this to go. And I don't really want to put it into challenges. Um, do you know what? I'm going to gift this to me um, and then I can buy myself a, oh, a multi bag of crisps. Or if you go to Home Bargains, two <laughs> multi packs of crisps. <laughs> yeah, I am definite. I'm going to pop that back in my purse. I hope everybody's OK with that. It's it's three pounds and I just don't have any challenges. Um, sorry, any sinking funds that allow me to do anything with three. And I don't want to put it back into challenges. Um, yeah, OK. Well, thank you so much for joining me. I really appreciate you. And um, you're all amazing. Um, your support, your comments, your likes. Honestly, they just, um, they're just amazing. You're amazing. And um, yeah, have a wonderful week. And um, see you next week for my birthday week. Yay! <laughs> Take care. Bye.